What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is free general collective reading for all signs, cats, who sag, everybody in between. Don't be the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate. Leave the rest. Thanks, everybody, for all the love and support to the channel. We're at 13,450 subscribers, so thanks so much for all the love and support to the channel. If you'd like to donate, this High Priestess Pro 5. The link's in the description box below. PayPal only. No cash at Movenmo. It's a very private, confidential way to donate if you choose to donate. Love and appreciate each and every one of you guys from the bottom of my heart chakra. Okay, so I received another channeling in. These are psychic, intuitive, prophetic messages. So one may apply, two may apply, two plus may apply, none may apply. Only you know your specific story and situation, not anybody else. So you have to plug um, these message or messages in your own particular life situation, however they resonate. If they do, please do not force anything that doesn't fit. Just want to let everybody know. Please do not, okay? All right. So the channel message I received was an Aquarius masculine married, legally married Aquarius masculine, very wealthy. And I've been pulling him in the past week. Y'all know that. Uh, I think it might be the same one, but you plug it in how it resonates. A very wealthy Aquarius masculine that is in an affair with the Pisces feminine, pregnant Pisces feminine. I heard the um, the affair is about to go all over the city. Um, and I heard all big, like all over the city. Um, so you plug it in how it resonates. He wanted it to be very, 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 very secret. But it is not. She is. Uh, she wants to capitalize off this, and she's about to. Oh my lord! You plug it in, how it resonates. Okay, so um, I heard he wanted it to be kept very, very, very secret. Um, but she, um, she her plans. It sounds like is to capitalize all, um, on it. So meaning make gain something from it. She wants to gain something from it. Uh, and I heard he's very wealthy and she's pregnant. So she might be that same Pisces femme I've been pulling in that is pregnant with, that thought she was pregnant with one and really in reality she's pregnant with three or not. She might be pregnant with one. She might be pregnant with two. She might be pregnant with three. She might be pregnant with 10 for all I know. I don't know if it's the same one I was pulling in in the sign readings for mid-July or not. I'm not sure. But whether she's pregnant with one baby or 10 million babies, um, she wants to capitalize off this wealthy Aquarius masculine. And for anybody who doesn't know, like I said, capitalization, capitalizing off something is basically gaining something off of it, um, making a profit, make something off of it, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Um, so, so she looked at him, I think, as an investment, is exactly what I think. That's She totally did. She told, my God, I heard she totally did. An Aquarius, another Aquarius is getting a huge ass wake up call. Okay, I heard she totally did. She totally did look at him as an investment, uh, as like an investment. She looked at him as a money train is exactly what she did. Oh my God. I wonder if he was paying her for sex initially. I didn't hear he was, but I mean, that would make sense. And that's just the truth. You know what I'm saying? Um, if she was looking at him as an investment, money money bags money bags money bags meaning uh for her to him um i'm i wonder and i heard he's very rich wealthy i think he was paying her for sex at the beginning i didn't hear that that's just my deductive logic reasoning i think he was paying her for sex and um she all she was seeing money bags up in her eyeballs because that's how she views him wow and i heard she is going to capitalize off of it Meaning she's pregnant with maybe one, three, 50 million kid, um, of his babies, it sounds like, currently. I heard it's about to go all over the city. He's legally married, meaning his spouse is, uh, has already found out or is about to. Not only his spouse, which the, he's wealthy and he has a legally married spouse, meaning they're very prominent in the community. I mean, and I'm just being for real, for real whether it's. Trust fund baby money, generational wealth money, money they're making out in the community right now at a good paying job or a combination or investments or lottery winnings. However that resonates, they are very wealthy. Um, and they're well known, both of them. But this Pisces film 
wants to be well known too. And she was looking for a come up or a latching on to somebody for success or fame or notoriety or something. I mean, this chickadoo had like dollar signs in her eyeballs and I'm just being for real. Um, and I hope she's about to, she's about to capitalize off of it. But I think one of the ways she's about to do it is to gossip it all over the city to make her rich and famous in her community. Because she's the rich man's mistress, basically. Pregnant with his kid or kids. And she's about to capitalize off this. She is such, so, so, so about to capitalize off this. But it's about to create tower moments for this family in a huge way. She's about to, okay, so I heard she is about to capitalize off it. So she is, she is about to, I don't think she's going to hold back. I think she's going to tell people. I heard she was. She was going to tell people. She has no qualms about telling people. And she's about to. But she knows it's going to benefit her because I need child support with him. Whether it's one child, two children, three children, 50 million children. She knows she's going to get a lot of child support. So she knows it's going to benefit her. And I don't think she cares. It doesn't sound like she doesn't care about being known as the rich man's mistress. Because that's basically what she is. But she's going to be known very publicly for it. And it sounds like she has no qualms about it. If you're going to be something, you might as well be proud of it to be about it. And that's just the truth. Uh, I would never want to be a rich, rich man's mistress. But this chickadoo apparently has no problems being a rich man's mistress. And okay, no judgments, ma'am. Just saying. But I would never want to be a rich man's mistress. And that's just the truth. But I heard another Aquarius is getting a huge wake-up call. So whoever this other Aquarius is, they could have Aquarius in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, or them in heaven or Jupiter charts. They're getting a huge wake-up call. Whoever you are, sir, ma'am, um, you could have Aquarius in your sun, moon, rising, Venus, or them in heaven or Jupiter charts if, um, if that resonates for you. But somebody in this mix is getting a huge wake-up call. I think she's a gossiper. I think she's a gossiper and... Um, and she's obviously out for money, notoriety, fame, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Um, and she's about to turn the wheel in her favor, is what it sounds like here. About to turn it in her favor. About to turn it in her favor is what I heard. So she, yeah, man, she's about to turn it in her favor. But it's going to cause huge negative tower moments for this family. She doesn't care. I mean, she, yes, she's... Um, She's very narcissistic. I'll tell you that straight up. She's very narcissistic. She doesn't care about breaking up this family, this marriage. Uh, she doesn't care about, she wants fame, notoriety, and the money from the child support. So she doesn't care who she's hurting in this family. She, uh, obviously, because she wouldn't have slept with the man to begin with if she really cared about the wife or the family unit. And that's just the truth. Just keeping 100 on here. She's in it for herself. She's in it for herself. She's in it for the fame. She's in it for to spread it all over the city, to make herself famous, to be the rich man's mistress, basically. Uh, and it sounds like it's about to work. It is about to work in a huge way. It is about to work in a huge way. Well, yikes, this is terrible. Uh, an earth sign masculine is getting a huge ass wake up call. Huge. Okay, so we got an Aquarius and an Earth sign masculine getting a huge ass wake up call too. So Aquarius, masculine, female Aquarius getting a huge wake up call and an Earth sign masculine, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, uh, masculine. You could have Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo in your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Ortho, Midhaven, or Jupiter charts. Y'all are getting wake up calls about this, but she doesn't care. But the thing is, is she wouldn't have cared. She didn't care at the beginning. She knew he was wealthy. She saw dollar signs. She didn't care about this family at the beginning. And that's just the truth. Um. Let me see if I hear anything else. Wow, man, this is something. An air sign. Fem is getting a huge ass wake up call too. An air sign. Fem is getting a huge ass wake up call too. So we've got earth sign masculine, air sign, fem, and a um, Aquarius getting huge wake up calls over here. Not these people. Not the wife, not that's going to have to endure all this public embarrassment, bless her heart. Not the wealthy Aquarius masculine that was thinking with his penis, basically. And she was thinking with um, money bags in her eyeballs. 
and she still is. She was focused on the goal. She got what she wanted, and he got what he wanted, but he didn't want it to go public, but she don't mind it going public. And she's about to turn the wheel in her favor and make it go public. But he don't want it to go public. Holy crap. And um, then we've got people over here getting huge wake-up calls. Wow, man. This is some shit. Oh. Spirit messages you have this like this. Mature man. An embarrassed family member of the wealthy masculine, Aquarius masculine energy. Um, they are about to move very soon, far away from this city. A, well, uh, a family member of this wealthy Aquarius masculine energy. Um, I heard they're about to move very far away from this city soon because they're so embarrassed. Um, this is, she she was in it for the money, man. If you didn't know this wealthy Aquarius masculine, if you're watching, sir, she was in it for the money, man. I mean, I'm sure you knew that. You, you're, I'm sure you're very um, intelligent, but you didn't want it out. But the thing is, she don't mind it out. And I heard she's about to make it go even more public. She don't mind it out, man. It gives her fame, notoriety, star as type status in her city. She doesn't mind being known as the rich man's mistress because she's about to get paid really freaking well for it, sir. Um, I guess you didn't keep that, take that into account. Um, and I'm serious. And there's about to be a huge divorce here. A huge divorce. And the wife is about to get way more than she thought she was going to out of this. And there, oh my God, and there's about to be a huge divorce here, a huge divorce, and the wife is about to get way more than she thought she was going to get out of this. Well, for an infidelity and a very public, um, ma'am, you should. I just want to say you should. Because one, this is infidelity, which is breaking of marriage pa pa uh, papers. And that's just the truth. Infidelity is one of the ways, i.e. this. Cheating, third party. That's infidelity for anybody who doesn't know. So infidelity, you could get in for infidelity, and I heard you're going to end up getting way more than you that you thought you were going to get out of this. And I think it's money, property, assets, or what have you, what have you, ma'am, because he has put you in such a public, embarrassing, publicly embarrassing situation. Y'all are very prominent, so it's not like somebody Joe down the street hears about it and then it's no news. Oh, nay, nay. This is huge. This is huge to a city. People want to know. People are about to know. People people are going to be talking about this man because y'all are so prominent in this city. Um, I think y'all have some high occupations or did or something of that nature. I mean, I'm feeling big, big money here. Big, bat, like, big money that's probably been in the family for a hot-ass minute. Money. And I'm just being for real. And probably more money on top of more money on top of more money because y'all probably have prominent positions in the community. Probably. But only you know your situation, not anybody else. Number five, mature man. A very mature masculine energy not in this hot mess express is about to get a huge wake-up call. About to start turning the wheel. This has gotten out of control. Okay. Uh, wow. This is a hot mess, man. A very, um, so a mature masculine energy not in this hot mess express. So not this person that thought with his penis and not his head. Um... Not the poor wife that's about to be publicly humiliated. Not the Pisces, pregnant Pisces fam that wants clout, fame, notoriety, and stardom in her city as known as the rich uh, rich man's mistress, pregnant mistress. Um, and I'm assuming not these people either. I think it's a different person. You have to plug yourself in where you fit, sir. You're a mature masculine energy. You could be 25, 35, 45, 55, 65, etc., etc., etc. It is not about your physical age for maturity. It is about your mentality, how you treat others, how you treat yourself, um, how you handle situations, mature mindset, how you handle situations. Um, 
So who, how whatever age you are, it's depicted as a uh, older man on here, but it doesn't have to be. You can be 25, 35, 45, 55, 65, and you can be any race, any ethnicity, any age. Just saying. So whoever you are, if you plug into this situation, because you have to plug yourself into the situation, however you resonate, if you do, sir, ma'am, well, in this case, you're a ma'am. I heard you're masculine. A man. Sorry, a man. Uh, sir. Um, I heard you're about to step up and turn the wheel in your favor. Uh, I'm not in your favor. Um, let me see if I hear anything else. You're about to start turning the wheel because you realize it's a hot mess express. Um, so I think you're about to do something outside the situation because this has already went public, it sounds like, and it's about to go even more public. It's about to go outside the city, way outside the city. It cannot be hidden. Oh my God, it's about to go way outside the city, way outside the city. It cannot be hidden. So this is about to just go everywhere. I think she has a large social media platform possibly. Or she talks to a lot of people, or she knows a lot of people, or what have you, what have you. But however that resonates, um, you are outside the situation, sir, and you're about to um, step up and turn the wheel. Um, turn it for you, turn it for somebody else. I'm not sure. Let me see if I hear anything else. About to turn the wheel for yourself and others. You were blackmailed in the past and lied to in the past not to do it, and you're about to do it. Okay, I heard about to turn the wheel for yourself and for others. You were blackmailed and lied to in the past not to do it, but you're about to do it. So whoever you are, sir, you aren't this hot mess express. I'll tell you that right now. You aren't these people. You are somebody else outside the situation, like sitting on the sidelines or just knowing about it. Heard you were blackmailed and lied to in the past not to do whatever you're about to do. Now, only you know what you're about to do, not anybody else. You have to plug it in how it resonates. But you were blackmailed and lied to not to do it. There were reasons you were blackmailed and lied to not to do it, though. But I think you have already woke up to and realized that or you're about to. And I think this has a lot to do with it. This is a hot mess. This is, I mean, she is about to capitalize off of it. She doesn't care. She's happy. But it's a, these people are about to just, the family, I heard, is about to be mortified. You plug it in how it resonates. Many, 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 many phone calls are about to be made. A lot of actions about to be had. This has gotten way out of hand. Many, 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 many phone calls are about to be made, and a lot of actions about to be had. It's about to get way out of hand. Um, or it's gotten way out of hand. So this has gotten way out of hand. This has already went public, but I heard it's about to go way more public, like outside the city. Inside the city, I mean, just all of damn place. I think you know these people, or you're connected to these people in some shape, form, or fashion, sir. Um, but you were blackmailed and lied not to do something in the past, so basically you're about to do it to help yourself and another or another's outside this hot mess express. But I think this hot mess express maybe was blackmailed or or lied to you in some shape, form, or fashion in the past, not to do what you're about to do, but you're about to do it, whoever you are, sir. I did hear you're masculine. This is, this is, this is something I'm just saying. All right, let me see if I hear anything else. Many shocking series of time events are about to occur with these situations very soon. About to speed, speed, speed it up. Many shocking series of time events are about to occur with these situations soon. About to speed, speed, speed it up. So you, sir, you're about to be a power play mover here. Uh, whatever sign you are and what 
what, whatever, whatever, you know. Um, I did hear masculine, but I feel, you know, when I hear masculine, energies can be reversed. So for some of you to be a fin that takes on heavy masculine, I heard masculine, but everybody takes on masculine fin energies. So for some, you could be a femme that takes on heavy masculine if you fit into this category or a masculine. You have to plug yourself in where you fit, but this is yikes. I mean, hearing about this, if you're not this, these people, then yeah, okay. But being in the middle of this crap, well, she don't care. She's about, she's about to get famous of being somebody's mistress, and that's just the truth. And narcissists, they don't care. They don't have empathy and sympathy. They're just in it for the money, the fame, the clout, the status which is basically her. So she wants to be in the limelight. It's about to embarrass the hell out of this family. But he thought with his penis, and, and I'm not trying to be crass, I'm just being real. He thought with his penis and not his head. And that's where we're ended up here with this situation. But I think you know this, sir. I think you're highly intuitive and you know this. Um, so you plug it in how it resonates, but you're about to turn the wheel in your favor and other people's favors too outside of this. Okay. All right. I love you guys. Everybody have a good day and namaste.